Hello friends, today we are going to discuss what is alpha oxidation of fatty acids and how it happens. So first of all we need to see what is alpha carbon and how it is oxidized. So this is a phytanic acid which is a fatty acid, long chain branched fatty acid and this is the carboxylic group, this is the alpha carbon and this is the beta carbon. Okay. So generally what happens? this carbon is oxidized and these two carbons are released as acetyl coa but when this carbon is branched or it is methylated this carbon cannot be oxidized by the process of beta carbon so what happens is alpha oxidation takes place alpha oxidation of the branch chain fatty acids like the phytanic acid takes place in the peroxisomes of the cells in which the alpha carbon is oxidized Okay, so the first step is phytanic acid is converted into phytanyl CoA by the use of ATP and coenzyme A. ATP is converted into AMP plus pyrophosphate, or and this coenzyme A is attached to the phytanic acid here, which is therefore the compound is known as phytanyl CoA. In the next step, the phytanyl CoA the alpha carbon is oxidized by an enzyme known as phytanoyl coa hydroxylase. This is the enzyme phytanoyl coa hydroxylase which oxidizes the alpha carbon here. See this alpha carbon is oxidized to OH group by the an alpha ketoglutarate is converted to succinate and O2 is converted to CO2. Fe plus 2 is the coenzyme of the phytanoyl coa hydroxylase enzyme. In the next step the 2 hydroxy phytanyl coa or the phytanyl coa which is hydroxylated is decarboxylated by an enzyme known as 2 hydroxy phytanyl coa lyase. This enzyme decarboxylates this, this substrate and converts into a product known as pristinal. Okay? So what happens is this carbon is decarboxylated and released as formyl coa and so you can see the decarboxylated product which is known as pristinal. In the next step, pristinal is again oxidized to carboxylic acid of the last carbon is oxidized to carboxylic acid by an enzyme known as aldehyde dehydrogenase in which NADP or NADP DP plus will be converted into NAD, NADH or NADPH. Okay? This oxidated, oxidized product is known as pristinic acid. In the next step, pristinic acid is converted to another product in which the uh, coenzyme A is added by enzyme known as acyl coa synthase. Okay, so ATP plus coenzyme A will give coenzyme A will attach here, and ATP will give AMP plus pyrophosphate. <coughs> so what happens is now this product contains beta carbon which has no methyl group on it. See, this is the carboxylic carbon this is the alpha carbon this is the beta carbon now the beta carbon has no uh, group on it methyl group on it so six cycles of beta oxidation can be performed on this uh, fatty acid and what the result is acetyl coa 3 acetyl coa methanyl methyl 2 methyl propionyl coa and propionyl coa 3 propionyl coa so this product will be formed by the alpha oxidation of fatty acids